Ourir Gott! I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hi guys, Diganani here. We're here at Camp Hayastan. We're sorry that you're not here, but you kind of are right now. So we're going to do a little tour and so that you can see everything that's been missing you. We're here at the picnic grounds. This is our drive down, as you see all the time. And our parking lot on the left, which is where you wait sometimes to get into camp. When you get here early, you get your number and you go in the parking lot. And here we go. Down the driveway we go. The sign is waiting for you for next year. Camp Hyastan, we have arrived. So we're going to do our little tour. I'm going to get out of the car and you're going to come on with me. Okay, here we are. We're at Camp Hyastan. Welcome. Do you remember when you arrived and those butterflies were in your stomach? Well, I hope during this tour, you kind of feel those butterflies. We'll see. But I'm going to put my mask on because there are some people here because we are doing Zoomistan and we've been filming. So everybody's around. You may see some uh, counselors walking about. So they're here. They're here for you. So here we go. All right, come on. We're going to take a little tour. And we have Angerui Kunad, who is our new executive director. Yay! And Zigan Sidon! They're here, come on. We're gonna go into the cabin circle. Here we are. What cabin do you think you would have been in? Hmm. Maybe 10? Five? Who knows? You'll have to wait until next year, unfortunately. But we are here for next year, and we hope that you come. We're going to go to the pool. As you can see, the pool. Hmm, we can't go in because it says keep out. But there's your pool. All right, we're going to go to arts and crafts. This was new last year. It's nice and clean. Our flags from last year are still hanging up. We have some arts and crafts from last year that are still on the windowsill, which was nice to see coming in here. 
over here. It used to be the old wash stands, is now a new bunk five. Next to our bunk five is the staff lounge and the laundry room. All right, here's the staff lounge. This is where the staff comes and hangs out. They have some couches. Oh, our picture fell down. Oh. We have our laundry room. This is what camp looks like when you're not here. Not quite the same. Those are all the garbage pails. <laughs> when you are a counselor, this will be your staff lounge. All right, let's go to the mess hall. All right, into the mess hall we go. And the kitchen is in the back. We're not gonna go in the kitchen today, but there's your mess hall. Flags are up. Let's go down to Uncas. The dock is there. I saw some beavers this morning swimming around. We have a little fixing to do with the dock because some of it's underwater. But other than that, looks amazing. Now, the amphitheater, which is right next to Uncas Pond, have brand new benches. And I believe that Unged John, his Boy Scout troops helped out with making these benches. They look great and they're ready for you guys to come back. Okay, let's go on up here. As you know, we have the pavilion, or AKA hockey rink, <laughs> dance pavilion. Here's our rec hall. And one neat thing about the rec hall, there's AC. Woo! If you want to cool off, you can go in the rec hall and feel mighty, mighty cool. So that's thanks to the ARS. The basketball court where a lot of you spend a lot of time playing. Okay, here we have the DQ, director's quarters. You can sit on an eye, sleep there, we sleep on the top. Some other ungids sleep on the bottom. There's four rooms downstairs, two rooms upstairs. All right, and here's the infirmary, not infirmary, health center, and our volleyball court. So let's go check out the archery. And here's our archery range. <laughs> it's kind of empty. Now we have the A field. As you can see, we can take a peek, see how big it is. Lots of soccer games happen here. Flag football, relay races, Olympic activities. So again, it looks good. Looks good, guys. All right, let's go. We're gonna walk back up. Circle of friends. We love our friends of Camp Hyaston. We have lots of donors and people that care about our camp and help it. So this is considered our circle of friends. All right, and our brand new bathroom is over here. Much improvement of the last bathrooms. <laughs> When I was younger, I had this, the old bathrooms. Oh boy, this is luxury compared to the old bathrooms. And the boys, this is the boys' side, and the girls' side's on the other side. We appreciate our brand new bathroom. I'm smiling under my mask, but you can't see me. <laughs> so those of you that are home and that have seen Camp Hyaston, if you have any cousins or friends that have never been to camp, show them. This is a great way to show where you go to Camp Hyaston. People may say, well, what is your camp like? Well, here's a video. You'd be able to show where you come for two weeks and stay and return. And again, we have lots of counselors that are around because we've been working hard to give you a fun Zumastan experience. We are thankful that you guys joined us. We miss you. We're very sad that you're not here, but you're here and we want to know that we are thinking about you all the time. And next year, we're gonna have a fabulous year. So I can't wait to see you next year here at Camp Hyaston. 
I hope you enjoyed my tour. <laughs> and um, again, I'll see you next year. At Camp Ayasan, we fold the American and Armenian flag, and we also raise them and lower them and sing their respective anthems. So this is how you fold the American flag. Uh, normally the boys holding the stars and the girls holding the stripes. <laughs> fold it in half, and then flip it down so the stars are facing down. Fold it in half again, flip it. Then the girl will fold the end three times. And then we do what we call boreg, and you just go across. You pull it so it's tight, and you just keep doing blood eggs until you reach your partner. And then the girl will take it, fold it, and that is flag folding. <laughs> so this is how you fold the Armenian flag. Put the orange to the blue, drop the red, and the blood drips so it goes down, and the wheat grows up so orange goes up. And then you fold this three times, the girl will fold that in three times, and then you do boat eggs and triangles until you reach your partner. And that is how you fold the Armenian flag. We also have a bunch of other flags. For example, the flag of Artsakh. Artsakh is a region that borders Armenia, and as you can see, this white line depicts the separation between the motherland and the region. Here we have the ARF flag, the parent organization to the AOIF. We have its slogan, Azatuchun Gam Ma, Freedom or Death, and its coat of arms, the Zina Nisham. In Armenian, the ARF is called the High Havapokan Tashnaktuchun. We also have one last flag, the flag of the ARFs, which also falls under the ARF's parent umbrella, and they provide relief to Armenians all over the world. And the ARS in Armenian is actually the High Oknuchun Miochun, founded in 1910. Hi, boys and girls! It's in Getaway Carry! I'm at Ankistan, my favorite place in the world, and uh, I'm gonna teach you all the camp song today, so I hope you enjoy. Uh, I'm gonna say a line, and Getaway Patiel is gonna help me out and repeat after me. So, Zabel and Quinn from Younger Group, if you're watching, Participate. Everybody better participate. So here it goes. We welcome you to Hayastan. We're mighty glad you're here. We welcome you to Hayastan. We're mighty glad you're here. We'll send the air reverberating with a mighty cheer. We'll send the air reverberating with a mighty cheer. We'll sing you in. We'll sing you out. We'll make you want to stand and shout. We'll sing you in. We'll sing you out. We'll make you want to stand and shout. Hail, hail, the gang's all here. We welcome you to Hayastan. Hail, hail, the gang's all here. We welcome you to Hayastan. Yeah! Yeah! But now we're gonna do it together. So, ready, Yedek, Chors. We, we welcome you to Haya Sun. We're mighty glad you're here. We'll send the air reverberating with a mighty cheer. Ra ra ra. We'll sing you in. We'll sing you out. We'll make you wanna stand and shout. Hail hail the gangs all here. We welcome you to Haya Sun. Yeah. Thanks, and get a carry for that great rendition of the camp song. But if you were to ask any alumni, maybe back in the 80s, 70s camp song would sound something like this. We welcome you to Hayastan. We're mighty glad you're here. We'll send the air reverberating with a mighty cheer. Ra, ra, ra. We'll sing you in, we'll sing you out. We'll make you want to stand and shout. Hail, hail, the gang's all here. And you're welcome to the highest. Yay!
Hey campers, welcome back to day two of Dance Move of the Day. This is, I'm a getaway pop to you. And I'm a getaway carry. And what's the name of our dance move today? So this dance you can do by yourself, you could do it with your dog, your sibling, your mom, your dad. It's called the Armenian Pop Dance. So, so get up out of your seats, get ready, get to see on. It's that time again. How do trees get online? They just log on. Pot of Angedner, Angedwi Kanat here with the Armenian word of the day. Today's word is leech, which means lake. Let's say it together on three. One, two, three. Leech! Passing it on to Anged Greg. Hi, Angedner. Today's word of the day is leech, so let's use it in a sentence. Legion mecha chenkona logal vorifidev bolshokka, which means we can't swim in the lake because there's bullshocks. Bye. Hi, everybody. I'm Angaro Yanish with your Camp Hayasan fun fact of the day. Our fun fact today is that the beachfront of Ankis Pond is named the Khamatian Beach. That's Angaro Sina. And that's Angaro Kerry. And this has been the Camp Hayasan News. Party Angeri Sina was found dead on the bench at the amphitheater with her phone in hand. It was not a pretty view. Angeri Kerry and Angeri Elizabeth were found ruthlessly and savagely killed underneath the pavilion. The only thing left was Angeri Elizabeth's phone. Angeri Patu, Angeri Mel, and Angeri Ani were found dead along the brick path in the cabin circle. Interestingly, their bodies were split evenly along the ground. Angeli Anush was found dead, coiled up under the trees, with multiple bruises. Once again, the only thing nearby was her phone. Urir <laughs> Gat!
Hunky Scott. <laughs>